Hi guys, welcome back to Just Lee Paper. And today we are going to be making slime. So let's get on with the video. So um first thing I'm gonna say is you will need glue. I just got some more glue, my melanta. Tide. Oh, heavy, such as washing up you know, laundry detergent. And you don't need it, but what you really want to hit is shaving cream. And obviously a bowl and a mixing thing. I'm using it on toothbrush because it's seriously old and no one will use it anymore. Because it's got a slime all over it. Yay! So the first thing I'm going to need is the glow. And we're going to just pop this in here. The glow. Now you don't need a lot, um, so I'm just going to do a little bit of this that then just keep on making more. Now I'm going to mix the glue, I normally don't, but I just feel like mixing it first. Now I'm just going to put some shaving cream in. Need to thicken it up because it's really watery. I just want to see which one looks best. Yeah, that one's fine. So I'm only going to use a little bit because I don't really like using it. Like shape, like foam because, I don't know why, but I'm not a fan of foam anymore. Shape and foam because it always goes watery. It's so annoying. Now we're going to use some tide. Now you do need to mix the um, glue and shaving cream in together so it's a nice texture. I'm just trying to see what one it's got nothing. It's got like a massive blob in it. Anyway, I got it up. So I'm gonna obviously I'm gonna pour this in here. You will only need a little bit at a time as if you add loads it will go super duper 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 hard than it before. So I'm just going to add a little bit at a time. And when I mean a little bit, I mean a little bit. <laughs> so I'm just going to mix that together now. And you will start to notice it will turn into a slime. Just add some more. And I will make some more slime because I didn't really want to add loads of slime. Just in case. Like loads of slime. The more glue you add, the more slime it will be. Yay! Once it starts like not sticking to the side, then you'll know it's slime. Because it when it sticks to the sides, it that's when it's forming into the slime. So as you can see, it will turn um blue because obviously the tide is blue. So then it will just change to blue. And I can see it's really sticky, so you just add more laundry detergent until it's not sticky. So I'm just going to mix that in. Now if you want a different colour, like you don't like blue, then just dye it a different colour. But beware, if you want it like purple, like figure out two colours that would make purple. Like blue and something would make purple. If that doesn't make purple, then like just don't do like the purple thing. Like if you still want purple, then just add a lot of food coloring or paint. It's up to you. Now, as you can see, it is actually very really sticky. So I'm just gonna keep on playing with it until it's not sticky. Be playing with it for a while. Might add some more. Um. Laundry detergent in it. Now, and uh, most of most people don't seem to get slime right, and I was at that moment in my life, and I couldn't get slime right at all. And I figured out a way, and you don't, if you still don't like get how it's not working. 
it's probably because you haven't got the right laundry detergent or you haven't got the right contact lens solution when you make fluffy slime or something because sometimes you need the right one and I know that contact lens solution needs boric acid in it otherwise it won't work so if you don't have boric acid in it and the way to check is um, to just buy it and bring it home because um, where's mine? my contact lens solution which is this um, I brought it from Boots but I didn't know if it was going to work or not and it doesn't say if it has boric acid in it at the back so I wasn't too sure but I know that it has to have boric acid in it so I just brought it home so as you can see it's coming into a slime now and I'm just going to get all the rest of the stuff off it um, if it's a little bit sticky then don't worry because just keep on kneading it and it will come to the right consistency or until it comes to the right consistency now if it's really really sticky you will need to add some more laundry detergent but as you can see mine isn't that sticky so I just need to keep on mixing it with my fingers and I'm probably going to make some more of this because I didn't really make a lot so I'm just going to add some more in a minute more glow and stuff do that now now this is probably going to be a lot now because I really want to make lots and lots of stuff if it will come out maybe yeah come out now okay so we just gonna actually I'm not going to make any more I didn't actually put any glue in now I was just trying to trick you guys I'm not going to make any more um, just because I'm, I'm running out of slime because I'm giving it all to my friends because they're paying me and stuff so um, I'm not actually paying me I'm joking I just give them some slime because they want some so yeah the slime's going oh well so we're just going to keep on playing with this slime until it's not sticky because as you can see it is pretty sticky Oh, if you can hear that wind out there, it is extremely windy. It's snowing, so. Now, if you don't have slime fingers, then I'm afraid you will not be able to make the slime because it will be too sticky for you. Um, and to find out if you have slime fingers, just quickly make some slime and make sure it isn't too sticky because you can kind of tell. And then just keep on playing with it and if it just keeps on sticking to your hands and like that one set like that like I can't do it because I have slime fingers so I'm just trying to get it so it's sticky. Right, so if it sticks to you like that and you can't get it off or anything like that, then you don't have slime fingers. Now I can get it off, but most of you won't be able to get it off, so I'm afraid uh uh you won't be able to play with slime. Now I'm just gonna add some more laundry detergent because it is really sticky. Now, like I said, you shouldn't add too much because otherwise it will go really hard. So, really, you just need to keep on playing with it until it's the right consistency. Now, if you've added too much of something in, just like say you added too much glue in, just and loads of like laundry detergent, or if you added too much laundry detergent, add more glue. But add more glue because um, that's what you need to do, really. As you can see, it's turned into slime and it isn't sticky anymore, so that's good. You don't want it to be sticky. And I like this slime because it feels really nice. So you want a good slime. I would say this one, with a thumbs up, I like this slime a lot. And compared to my other ones where I threw them in the bin because they were so hard, I think I've done a good job. So let's just see, it's good at poking. That's really good. Is it really stretchy? No. I love this slime so much, it's so cool. And I like the colour of it. If you can see like the colour of it, it's really pretty. It's so pretty. I love the colour of this slime. Thanks. Now, if you think it's really sticky, then just tell me. And if it didn't work for you, then I can 
I could show you what you did wrong and stuff to send me a video and don't forget to comment down below, subscribe and hit that bell and give it a massive thumbs up if you like this video. I know you can like and get plenty of thumbs up. We know you can. Well, I know you can. And I will see you guys next time in another slime video. Bye.